Hey everybody, got some serious bedhead going on today, so I figured I would uh, use a uh, Snapchat filter and uh, talk to you guys about the training log that I just posted on Google Classroom. So that's posted for you guys. Um, there are some, the workouts for you guys to work through, and there's links for every single exercise on there. So if you don't know what the exercise is, click on the link and it'll take you to a YouTube a video tutorial of how to do those. So you'll notice that you have two workout days and a lot of independent activities. Those independent activities can be the challenges that I post, the modified games, uh, workouts, or it can be something of your choosing. So the independent activities, um, you have a lot of free reign on. I've also posted your self-assessment that you're gonna do for the end of the month. The two key things that you are assessing yourself on is personal responsibility and mental toughness. So what exactly am I talking about with these things? So personal, so personal responsibility, uh, the description is consistently, often, sometimes, or rarely demonstrates appropriate attitudes and responsibility, consistently able to recognize weakness and build towards corrective action. So... Um, in our scenario, what exactly does that look like? Um, you know, maybe it's raining outside and um, I decide to go for a run anyways. That's showing appropriate attitude and that's showing um, that I'm meeting my responsibilities. I'm um, finding a way to be active. Um, maybe a weakness is that there was a rainy day and I decided I was just going to sit on my butt and watch Netflix. Um, and I noticed like, okay, that was a really bad um choice that I need. So next time it's rainy, I'm just going to get out to my garage and I'm going to do a workout right away and make sure that um, I'm being personally responsible about my health. The description for mental toughness is always shows the courage to keep trying no matter the level of adversity. Well, we're definitely seeing some adversity here when we don't have a gym to work out in and we probably don't have the right equipment. So um, this is a golden opportunity to showcase your resiliency. What did you do? What are, how are you being creative um, to make sure that you're getting your exercise in? So there's some questions on the self-assessment. Uh, how has self-isolation affected your workout or exercise routine? What are some obstacles that you've had to overcome in order to stay healthy and active? Have your emotions had an impact on maintaining an active lifestyle? So provide an example of these things for me within self-assessment. Okay, really looking forward to hearing about how you guys are being creative and staying active.